What the F word happened here? No idea. Look. Hello guys and welcome back on my channel. In this episode I am starting working on the BMW F900R. So this is my new project. As you can see, this episode will be a slightly different because the motorcycle is almost reassembled. So uh, now I am starting assemble it, but this is not so simple. So everything was destroyed, every firing, brackets, exhaust, as you can see, the brake lever, clutch also is destroyed, the uh, digital gauge was destroyed also. I have new reprogram and you will be seeing this uh, in a moment. And all I have to do now, I will unscrew the fender because I have to replace the wheel. I have, I yesterday I painted the wheel and now because as you can see the workshop is full, I don't have uh, more tools. So I have uh, one idea and I will replace the uh, front wheel in a different way. <laughs> so time to do this. Guys, quick uh, quick update. I am driving uh, with the BMW X3 that I recently repaired. You can see this on my playlist. I am driving for the front wheel to the BMW uh, F900R. So we will see on the place. I cannot record there, but I hope I will buy this rim. Uh, the price is 200 dollars, around 200 euro, because my rim is totally destroyed and I I cannot do anything with that rim. So meet me in the place, uh, I will show you the, the, the rim if I buy this piece. So see you guys! So guys, I had to paint the rim that I bought yesterday uh, and now I am happy. The rim looks very nice. I am starting baking it and tomorrow I can put this wheel to the motorcycle. Oh guys, I was able to unscrew the front wheel without uh, front lift. This is my method to do it, as you can see. And in the future, because this is very fine method, because I can hang the entire motorcycle up so I can unscrew the front wheel and rear wheel. I think I will uh, mount here, here and here, uh, one bar and uh, that kind of uh, lifts, electrical lifts, so I can press the button and the motorcycle will go up and I don't need to uh, use force, you know, so, so lift, motorcycle up and problem solved. So look what's left. I don't... What the F word happened here? No idea. Look. Phew, phew. So, I will show you now the wheel because the wheel is painted. Uh, and I am uh, driving to the tire shop to swap the tire. I will screw everything back together and I can work further with this motorcycle. And guys, I. I did uh, such a thing here, you see. I broken this bolt. This is the bolt from the pressure sensor. It should be here. And I have, have here a new one. I was uh, driving to the dealership because I have, my dealership is nearby. 
and I had to fix this issue. So I will show you guys now. Need that kind of tool. We need to uh, drill a hole. We have to drill a hole. Then we put here is uh, the, a few sizes, but I need a smaller one. And you have to screw this and the bolt is released. So I had to do this. Uh, and now I will put the pressure sensor and I will put the wheel together, back together. And I can put the wheel on the motorcycle. Finally. <laughs> guys I managed to screw everything here so the wheel is ready mm, now I will take the tire and time to go to the tire shop and they will uh, put me this wheel back together and finally I can assemble the front wheel And guys, also I received the key for BMW BMW 900R. So this is the key. Let's find out. Let's do a small unboxing. I'm wondering because this is my first bike with Spark K. Such a big K. Whoa! Now I can try to launch the motorcycle. Hoo -hoo. Guys, don't do this at home. Also, I was able to buy digital gas dash, and now I am programming it. As you can see, the motorbike is the motorcycle is connected to Ethernet, and the guy from the other side doing his magic. So guys, this will be it in today's episode. Hope you like that kind of movie. On the next episode, I will be painting the filings and assembly this bad boy up. So, please watch the next episode. See you guys, bye!